over the past three days, three illegal firearms and 47 rounds of ammunition were recovered in the St. Catherine North Police Division. The first one was on Saturday, November 9th, shortly after midnight along Job's Lane, a man attacked police officers who were in plain clothes with a firearm. The police officers immediately took evasive action and the man was shot and injured. A 9mm pistol loaded with 10 rounds was seized from this man. He was transported to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. The second firearm was seized when members of the Air 5 Fugitive Apprehension Team conducted an operation in Berwick District, that's in the Riversdale area, in search of a wanted man and his cronies. On the approach of the police, one man engaged the police in a fierce gun battle. He was shot and injured. He was later transported to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. A firearm loaded with an extended magazine, and this magazine has the capacity to hold 30 rounds. So this magazine was recovered in the firearm with 14 rounds. Another magazine loaded with 10 rounds was also recovered. Two police officers received minor injuries. These injuries are not considered life-threatening at this time. The third firearm was seized about 2 a.m. on Monday, November 11th, while the St. Catherine North Police, they were in the process of shutting down an unpermitted event. This was in the St. Diego Gardens area of Spanish Town. A man who aroused the suspicion of the police was searched, and a 9mm pistol loaded with 13 rounds was seized from him. He was subsequently arrested. Since the start of the year, 51 illegal firearms and 525 rounds of ammunition have been seized by the St. Catherine North Police. This is in comparison to 46 firearms and 453 rounds of ammunition for the same period in 2023. Now, these intensified operational activities will continue across the division.